This will also let you do this for two Macs that are next to each other and signed into the exact same Apple ID. So that if you have an, iPad, an iMac and a laptop set up next to each other, the same kind of thing applies. They're just an extension of each other that way. And it automatically switches over between the two in terms of how they connect with Bluetooth, how they connect with Wi-Fi. This does require that Wi-Fi and Bluetooth be on um, because it uses the same kind of stuff that your watch uses to figure out if you're nearby your computer to do an authentication. It's, it's Wi-Fi time of flight as well as Bluetooth connectivity to make those kind of things happen. This is a really magical experience when you get to try it. If you have creatives that work with iPads all day or, or work with Macs and iPads together, this is a great way to bring those two platforms together and to essentially use them as a common tool um, so that you can easily take things that come directly out of Mac OS and put them in iOS and vice versa. Please subscribe and check out more content from us.